If you have heard about induction of labor using sex and you wondered how, then this video is for you. As I will be talking about the effectiveness of sex to level initiation. And if you're new here, you're welcome. Please try and subscribe. Press on the bell icon button to get notified each time I upload a video. Um, you'll be seeing me more in this regalia. This is because if you have observed for a long time, I have not made an update. Did you call? And I responded. Instead of waiting for the perfect time to go to the studio, I thought it wise to make use of my breaks out to work to make videos. So if you see me more in this outfit, I hope you like it. Drop what you think in the comment section. Now let's listen and learn. Naturally, Labor starts from 38 weeks to about 40 weeks or 41 to 42 in some cases. Now when you get to this point, mothers sometimes get anxious and they become scared. Especially when they are not seeing any sign of labor coming. Do not worry, why don't you start labor yourself at home? Mm -hmm. And you can do that by sex. Having sex with your husband frequently, if possible, every day. Yes, I said it. Every single day. Yes. And this is because once you have intercourse with your husband, he deposits sperm into you. And sperm contains tons of what we call prostaglandins and these prostaglandins help in the dilatation of your service your service is the door to your womb and this door is sealed temporarily once you get pregnant we mentioned we talked about it in um, um, in our previous video when we talked about signs of labor i'll drop the link in the comment section so that you go check it out you have not seen it so this service gets that dilated because of the effect of the prostaglandin so it's supposed to dilate from 1 cm to about 10 cm uh, before you are allowed to push out your baby so you see having sex especially when your husband ejaculates helps uh, your service to dilate and once service starts dilating level has already started again you are supposed to reach orgasm yes you're supposed to get to orgasm and release yourself uh, this when you get to your peak it's a result to a release of a hormone known as oxytocin this hormone is a hormone that um, helps start contraction. Contraction is the pressure you feel, the tightening you feel, pain you feel in your abdomen, in your tummy once labor has started. You know when you watch the movies and you see a woman that is pregnant, is about to give birth and there is pain and they are dragging, that's contraction. Okay, so uh, this oxytocin helps um, you to contract. Okay, um, I know sometimes when I talk about having sex um, during our antenatal clinic days, 
My mother would look at me like, are you really serious? I am telling you, my vagina is on fire and you are telling me to have sex. I understand. Okay, if this is your case, uh, you feel pain in your vagina wall, you feel like um, he's trying to tear apart, he's as if he's on fire and you cannot allow your husband to penetrate. Then I will recommend you go with a uh, foul play, um, allow your husband to uh, stimulate your nipple, okay, let him uh, fumble with it around your nipple areas. This also stimulates the release of oxytocin. And once oxytocin is released in the bloodstream, uh, it initiates contraction. And once contraction starts, labor has started. Okay, so aside nipple stimulation, you can also involve in oral sex. Okay, let your husband stimulate your clitoris with his tongue or his hand, his fingers. Okay. Uh, your clitoris is a sensitive area in your vulva, okay, not your vagina. Uh, you just, a, a slight protrusion uh, towards the place you need for, okay, as a little uh, projection there, they put something that protruded a little. Uh, if I see an image, I will link it to the video, but if I don't, just try and browse about it. Discuss it with your husband. Let him use his tongue to stimulate around that area, or he uses his finger. This will cause you to reach orgasm. And once you get to orgasm, it will cause the release of oxytocin, like I said, and labor will start. Okay, so remember we discussed the penetration and ejaculation from your husband nipple stimulation by your husband either with his fingers or his tongue yes and then you reaching orgasm so you can as well get to orgasm during uh, sexual intercourse but if you are having pains down there and it's difficult for you to involve in any form of penetration you can speak to your husband have that discussion and let him um, get you to orgasm through stimulation of your cell, of your clitoris using his tongue or his fingers. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you find this video very helpful. And please do well to subscribe, like, view, comment. Please, I need feedbacks. Comment. I need feedback. Say something. Let me know what you think. Okay, if you have something else to ask, uh, say it in the comment section. If you have a question, also say it there. If it if the answer is going to be bulky and I can't type, then I'll make a video with it. Okay. Um, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.